going on everybody this is more power here welcome back to the channel hopefully you guys are having a powerful day today we're going to be hopping back on to call of duty infinite warfare to check out uh dlc 3 and uh, there's some really good dlc uh maps in here that i'm really looking forward to playing so let's go ahead and hop on and see how we can do all right guys so we are on four yeah it's four not four a this is actually one of the maps i was looking forward to once we heard uh or got the description of all the maps for DLC 3 um, because I love mini golf and this is probably gonna be one of my favorite maps I love the fact that these developers are actually um, straying from the norm on a conventional map Like in Black Ops 2, you had Grind, that was a, uh, that was a skate park map. You have Splash on Black Ops 3, that's a, um, a water park themed map. It's just these innovative, uh, out of the, the norm maps are where it's at, and I enjoy these the most. And I know World War II is probably not going to be able to, to do non-conventional maps because I know they're trying to stick with the World War II setting and there's not a whole lot of room for for oh I love this gun this is my favorite gun in this game just because it melts um, but I am still excited for World War II um, I haven't very covered it much on the channel but World War II is actually uh, my favorite war um, is one of my favorite historical uh, favorite points in history and I, I'll go more in depth into that when we get um, oh, I'm not going to be able to get over that way when we get closer to uh, when we get closer to World War II's launch Oh, and I had to go and die there. That's unfortunate. This is the most violent game of putt-putt golf you will ever see. Even though it's not really putt-putt golf. I call it putt-putt golf, but it's actually called mini golf. Uh, but I actually love it. When I was a kid, that's... That and bowling is one of the things that I absolutely... I just got blown into oblivion. But anyway, anyhow, um, when I was a kid, I loved to go play mini golf. Um, I'm not too big into actual golf, but mini golf is where it's at. Get wrecked. Ooh, I got the whiteout camo. The MV4. I don't know why it took me that long to aim at that trip mine. Get wrecked! Might want to reload before I try to get into a gunfight and run out of bullets. I love my Astros. Astros are the greatest invention for gaming of all time because with because you can hear the footsteps so well. Get wrecked even though we killed each other at the exact same time which I think is funny. Got him. I just totally stole that kill from that guy. Oh no, oh no. I was just getting double teamed, not even knowing where I was getting killed from. I got the equalizers. I just, I don't do as well with those as I would like. But I'm gonna go, I'm gonna give them a go anyways. 
if I'm actually able to find anybody. Ally drone package entering airspace. Yeah, and I just, I can't use those to save my life. All right, guys, so we're back. Um, we're going to do the second map. Um, actually, the second favorite map that I like on this uh, DLC from my short time getting to play it. Um, this is Bermuda. Beautifully, beautifully designed map. And then I'm also using the Trencher, I believe it's called. I will say the DLC maps um, actually look really good. Um, I would actually rather have these DLC maps as the standard uh, standard maps, the base maps that you get with the game. Get wrecked, scrub! Alright, like I said, I would rather have these as the base maps than anything. Just because I feel like they... They're putting more effort into these maps. Get wrecked! This gun is amazing. I, I really haven't gotten a chance to use it much. Um, because I really... I've only hopped on Infinite Warfare twice lately. And that was yesterday after I downloaded the, uh... Or after the DLC downloaded onto my PS4. Because I'm actually recording this the day after the DLC comes out. Um, which will this will go up on a Saturday more or yeah Saturday morning, but so far so good. We're gonna follow this guy here. Oh, teammate got him. I don't even know where these guys are coming from. And I'm getting shot in the back. We've lost the lead. Even though I was praising my Astros in the last game. Right now it's get wrecked and and I've that's the second no, third time. Well, second time with a regular gun. That I've killed the enemy and then We've he's killed the me at the same time. Get wrecked, Scrub. Get wrecked. Good thing teammates got him. That X Eon is actually probably one of the most overpowered DLC weapons we we have in any Call of Duty game. I gotta make a video on, but I think this is the best um Sys DLC system we have is Infinite Warfare's and Modern Warfare Remastered's. Oh, if if I would have been able to see the enemy, I probably would have. I probably would have got a two piece. Try to kill me with a pistol. Now, there are some pistols that can outgun SMGs, but not a lot. There we go. Gotta be careful back here as to not get shot in the back. Oh. I leveled up, which I haven't done on this game in a long time. Um, but back to um, to reviewing this map, I like it's. I feel like it's balanced um, to an extent. There are some spots where it can get really cluttered, and that's evidence in like these little places nooks right here where there's just like so many different ways like right here there's three different ways you can you go and that goes to where you can um, avoid camping but it's not great for the sense that 
You have lines of sight cut off. And you get shot in the back really, really easily. That's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Um, I actually really enjoyed these maps. This map pack is actually probably one of the better map packs for Infinite Warfare. I know all of them actually are pretty decent and uh, better than the actual standard maps. And I've said that in the video. But um, I really think they're going to be, these are decent maps that I can actually play on Infinite Warfare. I'm not actually going to play Infinite Warfare too much um, because I have so many games that I want to play. But I just wanted to bring you guys... A little bit of a review for them, but if you enjoyed, leave a like. Let me know in the comment section if you're still playing Infinite Warfare. If you downloaded this DLC, what do you think? Let me know in the comment section. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. And as always, I'll catch y'all on the next video.